Alright then my friends, so we've created this to news app now, but what I'd like to do is just add a couple more features to make this app sparkle, if you will. So the first thing I'm going to do is a tiny little bit of validation in here to make sure a user actually types something instead of just clicking add to do, because that makes no sense right there. And then secondly, I also want to show you how to do alerts. So a little message that pops up. So what we're going to do is validate this field. If, say, for example, the word that a user types in here is less than three letters long or something like that, then what we're going to do is show an alert to say, look, you need to add something in that's a bit longer. So that's what we're going to do. The first thing we need to do is perform this check inside the submit handler. When a user clicks on this, that is the point we want to check. Look, whatever they've typed in here, does that equal to at least three or four characters long? So we need to do a little if check inside this submit handler to do just that. So let's say if, and then in here we'll say text, which is the text we receive, and that is the value inside the text input. If that dot length is going to be over three, so at least three characters long, then we're going to update the state. So let's grab all of this stuff, set to do's, cut it and paste it right here. So that's the case if this is at least three characters long. So let me try this out first of all and wait for this to reload, blah, blah, blah. Okay, so if I just type in, for example, D, add to do, it's not gonna add it. D, D, still doesn't add it. D, 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 nope, because it needs to be greater than three. But the minute I add a fourth character, it is gonna add that, so that's fine, but if it's, say, two characters and we're trying to add it, then we don't really know why it's not adding this. Nothing's telling us we can't add something that's two letters long. So that's the point. We want to add an alert. So if this fails right here, this check, instead of setting to do's, what we're going to do is instead show an alert. Now, to do that, we need to import the alert component from React Native. That comes with it out of the box. So in here now, we can then say alert dot alert. We call the alert method on the alert object. And inside here, what we need to do is pass through a few different arguments. The first one is going to be the title of the alert. And we'll just say, oops. So that's the title. The second one is going to be some kind of message. And I'm going to say to do's must be over three cars long. So three characters long. And I've done that all in capitals. I really shouldn't do that. So let's write this again. To do's must be over three chars long. And then the final parameter is going to be an array over here. And inside that array is going to be some different objects. And each object represents a little button that's going to be on the alert. And when we click on that button or press that button, it's going to close the alert. Now, inside this object, we can specify the text of that button, which is going to be, in this case, understood. We can also add an on press property, and that could be just an anonymous function, which is going to say console.log and then alert closed. OK, because when we click on this button, it is going to close the alert. OK, and that's all there is to it. So let me save that now and see if this works. So if we come over to the form in a second when it loads and try just adding one character, add to do, and we get this alert. So there's the title, the text, and then the button. When I click on this, understood, it closes it. And if I take a look at the tools over here, we can see it logged that to the console, alert closed when we clicked on that. If I do it for two characters, it pops up again. If I do it for three, pops up again. If I do it for four, we don't get that and it adds it to the list. So there we go. That's how we can use a little bit of validation and also show an alert.